Today we're at the uh, Pool of Siloam, which is right here next to me. You'll remember that in John chapter 9, it was the Pool of Siloam where Jesus put mud on the eyes of the man who had been born blind, and he told him to go wash in the Pool of Siloam. And so that's what we have right here by us. Also in Luke chapter 13, the scriptures talk about the Tower of Siloam having fallen on top of some man, and that would have uh, been right on top of the hill here where the Tower of Siloam was. We just came out of Hezekiah's Tunnel, uh, which was about a 20-minute walk in water that ranged from ankle deep to thigh deep as we came through there. And it was a tunnel that King Hezekiah had built to help transport water when the, the city was being besieged and also perhaps even as a way of escape. There's an even older Canaanite tunnel that runs uh, alongside that that was also built by the Canaanites before the Israelites ever took this uh, part of the country over. So the Canaanites had a, one tunnel built and then Hezekiah had built another and it ends up right here at the Pool of Siloam.